Good morning. We're in Thailand. It is 5.46 a.m. So like 6 p.m. in New York. I've been up since 1.30, which honestly I really like because I get to do like all my work. And the sun is so hot, you guys can't see, but like, I don't know if it looks like I have some color, maybe. Also look at my shirt. I'm a better person on vacation, and that is true. But the best time to take pictures and content is like early in the morning before the UV hits 12. How many of you guys, a villa tour business place is literally the most insane res resort, like house I've ever been in. And it just deserves its own villa tour, but You'll see, there are so many aesthetic places to take content here. Becca and I are hard at work, getting ready. You're gonna come along with us. Today's actually a fun day. It's our third day or second day here, and I feel like we're finally like, in a good routine, except for the fact that we keep waking up so early in the morning. we've done so far since we've been here for a couple of days so first off the journey getting here it was a 26 hour travel day i posted about it on tiktok but we flew from new york to dubai which was 12 and a half hours then from dubai to phuket it was six ish and we ended up like it's weird we like traveled forward in time and then when we go home we leave the 16th and we get back on the 16th which is crazy like time travel but the emirates lounge you guys was insane and i actually posted a travel with me so you guys are gonna see the lounge and like the whole thing but actually i've never seen a lounge that big it had showers so many different rooms and it was such a so cool not to mention the emirates flight had it was a double decker flight had a lounge the business class was like it was a whole experience we landed the 11th at night so it was basically just kind of like a go straight to sleep we woke up then the next day was just super nice and chill like we didn't do anything and sometimes after a long travel day that's just like what you need then that was our first full day then yesterday we had a boat day dolce vita knows how to have a boat day like nicole who's one of the women who works on the dolce vita team the best aux i've ever heard in my entire life like vibes were just pumping it was a vibe and then we went to the pp islands pi fi islands whatever you want to call them water insane we saw monkeys yeah it was just like a whole boat day then Becca and I have literally been going to sleep at 8 p.m. every single day. And today, we've got chill day in the morning, a super cool brunch, and then more chill time, and then we're going into town tonight, which I think is just super fun, which is why I chose this day to bring you guys along, because we're going into town, and like we're really gonna experience Phuket. Guys. This is what Beck and I have been waking up to literally every single day. I've said this once and I'll say it again. Rare Beauty makes some of the best highlighters known to man. Like both their powder formula and their liquid, it's gonna make you literally gleam and shine. Like look at my nose. Okay, I'm all ready for the outfit. I'm going to be wearing this Kai dress. Secret. I'm actually just reshooting in this dress because I didn't get the picture that I wanted. So I've already worn this. This is what the dress looks like. 
you can't fully see. It's actually very flattering. But now we're gonna go run and see if we can catch the sunrise for these pictures. Essential. Now we go. The sun sees Wait, look at the water. Holy shit. Being a girl means literally throwing your shit absolutely everywhere. I promise our room doesn't look like this most of the time, but right now. So now that the sun is up, everyone had the same idea. They're shooting content down there. They're shooting content over there. No one came to play. So now I need to sort of decide what look I want to do next or just like what we're doing because again the best time to shoot content is in the morning before it gets super hot um i'm like maybe i'll switch my hair up but i have a sick outfit that i oh my god i'm not even gonna it's just too good all these pictures that becca took also this is why she's my plus one because i know i'm guaranteed an instagram slay if becca takes it so i sat for a couple minutes and oh my god i have bug bites now i'm going to change into a bikini and I think this cute little Astra Resort dress because I have to film some TikToks in it that I didn't film yesterday. And you know, it's a cute, it's a cute little vibe. So I'm gonna go do that. And then I'm also going to film a TikTok and you're on the tripod, so I have to switch them. This is the struggle, the struggle. But that's like the plan. And then we'll go up to breakfast. I just got in the shower to wet my hair with this. And now I have water all over my face. And I kind of feel like I should just take a shower at this point because what am I gonna do now? That was like the craziest experience. Damn. Now we're headed upstairs for breakfast. I brought Coco. Cause she hasn't been up here yet. Oh, Good morning. morning. In the kitchen. Oh, <gasps> fresh squeezed orange juice. This was the life I was meant to live. The soft life, the easy life. The good life. <laughs> Cheers, mom. Becca forgot her towel, so I'm being a good friend and bringing her a new one. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. So it's 11.46. Crazy, because I've been up since like one in the morning. Um, we shot some content. I did it with a photographer. Super excited for those pictures. Literally, there is barely any time has passed. We have brunch at one. So I just got out of the shower. I'm gonna sit here for a second. The new Love is Blind season finale just came out. So like maybe we'll do a little preview of that. I'm so obsessed with this place. Like literally look at outside the view of my room. I just, I just, I can't stop saying that I love it here because it's so beautiful and I'm, Completely and all. And then after brunch, we literally have like five hours and then we're going to the night market, I believe. They send a text about it. Yeah, night market at 6 p.m. Oh, and then we're just gonna grab some like light bites while we're there. But honestly, uh, when I say that I've been beasting, they had the most insane green curry yesterday. And I don't know how some people don't like Thai food. Thai food is like my number one go-to order. Whenever I like order at home, Sue, they're one of my favorite restaurants in the city. Like it really just chef's freaking kiss. So this is the rat and bow dress that I'm wearing to brunch. Mm. 
No wrinkles are allowed. Dress has been steamed, makeup is done. Let's go put it on. I haven't put it on yet, I've never tried it on. And sometimes that's risky, but we're really just hoping and praying for the best. We're ready. Two girls on the go. Um, he, he just, like, Clay, as a you're weird. Man, Trevor, husband, you're like, mad weird. Jet Ramet, you're mad. Like, I don't know where they're picking people, and maybe it's just what Seattle. No, this is like Charlotte or something. Well, if you're choosing to go on Love Is Blind, even I'm not even. You probably have a little something off about you. Yeah, this is just like a needed rest moment, and I just. I've got a lot, a lot of things going through my mind. Oh my God, look who it is on Becca's phone. Literally can never escape her. <laughs> Would you ever want to escape me though? Not really, I'm not mad about it. Okay, I'm up for my little nap. I had a post nap snack, which is a mango, and now we're gonna do a villa tour. Becca's coming on the villa tour. <laughs> I figured we're gonna start all the way at the top. Becca and I haven't even done like a full, full Villa tour, but give me one second. I'm gonna speed my way to the front door and then we'll start from top to bottom. Okay, so this is the outside. Literally just look how gorgeous it is. I kind of wish there were koi fish here, but you know the vibes. You get to our front door. If you saw my TikTok, this is the door that we entered in when they gave us flowers and it was insane. Hey Vogue, welcome to my Thai Villa crib. So you walk in and this is the first living room, I guess you could call it. Just look at the view and how literally insane it is. We can go out there, but like, what's the point in that? And this is the same room that we had brunch in, but you know, they really just, they fixed it up. So then you can either walk through the side door or walk through here and we get to the kitchen where we had breakfast this morning. Has this cool little bar situation. This is where we have all of our meals and then another little living situation or little living room. And then you can walk up these stairs and get to a massive jacuzzi up on the roof. A second little patio and again the views insane so this property has not one not two not three pools but four the jacuzzi being one up there this is pool number two pool number three down there and then a fourth pool that you can't even see and then i believe that this is the master bedroom where the Dolce Vita staff is staying, or um, the team. And next on our tour, we're going downstairs. Oh, wait. Oh, spa. We see this spa. Okay, so this is the spa and or the massage room. I got a Thai massage right over here. And I kid you not, I was like laying and the way this woman was like bending my body in ways that I've never been bent before, like leg was going up, my back was cracking, it was a whole thing. But great experience. And I'm feeling very loose and limber. Then you have here where we have a jacuzzi and then, oh, someone's showering in here, but this is also a steam room. Literally, this place has everything you could imagine. 
and more. So now that we've done all of that, it's time to go downstairs. Come on guys, we're going downstairs. Um, so this is my crib. I love it here. I don't play pool, I just like to lounge here. Um, let me take you to my golf simulator. I've never played golf a day in my life, except for a wee mini golf. But uh, pick up a little, little club, do a little tree. <laughs> Incredible. Thank you. Anyway, these are all my clubs. Normally I have a caddy, but let him have the day off. Anyway, keep going. This is living room number four with our movie theater. Um, should have washed one blind up here, but you know, <sighs> I forgot. And this not only houses. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. All my friends. All my friends. Okay. Oh, this is my fridge. It is stocked with chilled glasses, coconut, all the beverages that you could ever need. Is this not a Chris Jenner fridge? I thought so. All right. I also like to always keep a coconut bush for safekeeping as well. It's not just decoration, it has purpose. I actually haven't been back here. This is new. Oh, bathroom. I'd, I'm afraid to open that door. I don't know what's behind there. Okay, we've got my fun little foosball table. I uh, used to play this a lot growing up as a kid. Had to put here for memorabilia. And welcome to my gym. A quick look at the latest and greatest. We've got this random monkey pole thing. Let's see if Aloe Jim is <laughs> really putting you to work. Nope. I'll try again this time. All the weights, most of all, really just everything you need. All right, come on. And since I always have guests here, I've got bedrooms off to there. All right, who's ready for pool number technically two or three? Here she is. Beautiful, stunning, amazing, just like me. You're in a silly, goofy mood. <laughs> thing about this pool. It has a little glass thing so you can see your legs when you're Like I said, we've got enough seats for all my friends. My friends. <laughs> you guys know I only date basketball players, so I've got a full basketball court right here for them to practice. Consider a girlfriend. Also a tennis court. And or pickleball. And we've only got two more places to go on this grand tour. I told you, four pools. Not two, three, four. So, um, and then we've got a private beach down there. Oh, come on, one last thing to show you. <laughs> so last three-ish spots on our tour. Another fridge, fully stocked with water, Sprite, Beverginos, the whole thing. Up. Oh. Tripods. Is that yours? No. Oh. Tripods everywhere that you need it. And this room, very special to me. We have a sauna. Where I like to think that it's left on all the crazy parts of my day. Last two spots. Now, I don't have a child yet, don't know if I'll ever have a child, but in case I do, a mini playground to keep them entertained, with the nanny, of course. And last but not least, one of my favorite places to lounge, right here. And because I like everything to be about myself, if people aren't paying attention to me, gone. <laughs> welcome 
This is the end of my high high grocery work. I'm gonna go everybody to go to this high night market, but I hope you enjoy. Toodles. If you thought you were done with me, you're not. Because now we're headed to the night market. Here are our OOTDs. My top is from Madewell. My skirt is American Eagle. My shoes are Dolce Vita. My dress is Skims. My purse is Naked Vice. And my shoes are nowhere to be found. <laughs> so I will be looking for them. <laughs> Wait, these are so cute. Oh, I have these shorts actually. No, look at them close. I'm like, oh, I don't see them. Okay, sugar mama. I know, please call. Okay. Rich. I'm rich. the end of the day i'm back playing horizontal playing house with becca the market was so cool so many different food situations happening we ended up getting mango sticky rice i think this may be my fourth mango i've consumed today we just got in bed it's eight it's 9 20 p.m that's like one of the late that's like late for us normally we're already asleep i hope you enjoyed today's vlog let me know if travel vlogs are something you guys want because i have three more trips in march that i think could be great little 24-hour vlog situations i'm so excited for just this summer just everything's ahead i have very high ups for i am exhausted my eyes are literally like closing as we speak so i'll see you guys next week and i hope you enjoy it and as always let me know in the comments what you guys want to see, your comments, your thoughts, the whole thing. I love you guys and I'll see you guys next week.